Is the story you're about to see true? Well, no one really knows. No one as yet has been able to prove or disprove it. And so it remains in limbo, a part of that vast, uncharted world of psychic phenomena beyond our powers of explanation. Laughter is an international language, and the clown, the prince of laughter. <laughs> he is a universal phenomenon. He's as old as man's culture. He always has been and always will be with us. He's the heart and the essence of the circus, or the festival, the carnival. Always the very center of noisy, happy crowds. It's the same everywhere. China, Russia, Germany, Italy, America. But where does the gaiety disappear to when the festival is over? The circus ended, the carnival closed for the night. What happens to the droll man in the ridiculous costume? The carnival grounds are empty now. And the shrill piping voice of the calliope, still. The performers in their trailers are speaking in hushed tones because something happened here tonight, something that was so bizarre that even the normally superstitious carny folk found it almost impossible to believe. Just a few hours ago, the first shadow fell. A psychic shadow. Here, Carnival! Where are you going? You said we could have some fun. I said if you behaved yourself. Well, didn't I? Come on. Look at Clown! Look. A clown. A putty nose and a grease paint smile. The man inside the clown? Anonymous. X. But that doesn't matter because usually the only function of the clown is to make us laugh. Usually. Double ride. Now let me see. What am I going to have? Well, you ain't going to have anything, little girl, till I see some sort of identification. <laughs> I'm a married woman. Well, I'm his wife. Look. And of age. Well, sorry, but that's the rule. Don't you worry. We all make mistakes. Anyways, I just want a, a pop. Sure. You know, you had me there for a minute. I thought he was your, uh, <coughs> well. <laughs> What's so funny? What's so funny? And who asked you? Come on over, sit down. I'll bring you your pop.
you know. Beat it. Beat it. a smile that makes up for a thousand words. A million, in fact. <laughs> oh, would you? My hair? My pretty soft hair? I like it, too. I sure do. I guess maybe I oughtn't to say that. But it's real nice. Like silk. You... Go ahead. Feed it all you like. Didn't I tell you it's smooth and silk? <laughs> Must be sweet to have someone like you around. Someone who never says anything mean and nasty. Will you leave me alone? Will you get out of here and leave my wife's hair alone? He's just sweet. Yeah, he's just sweet like all the others. He likes my hair. He's real me. sweet. He's a nice clown. He likes your hair. It's lovely hair, isn't it? Nice. It really is lovely hair. There. You like her hair? Well, here. Oh, here. You can have it. Now feel it all you want.
mean you can't make it? Well, what am I supposed to do? Bust out crying or something? Oh, go fly a kite. Want to buy me a drink? Go away. Go away. Come on now. Is that a way to talk? Leave me alone. opens that door till the police get here. But Buck said he saw the Buck whole was thing was shooting is... off his mouth. Yeah, but I caught him red-handed, I tell you. I saw him with my own eyes. I don't care what you saw. Pippo couldn't do a thing like that. Anybody knows Pippo wouldn't hurt a fly. He's big, he's dumb maybe, but... But he... I saw him. He could talk for himself. When the police get here, he can write down what happened. Oh, that poor innocent girl. Stab with them wicked scissors of his. I always knew there was something wrong with that Pippo. You mind your own business. All right, back to work. Let's break it up. Come on. Look at that dummy. Look at his face. Grinning. Just grinning. As if it was some big joke. Usually his only function is to make us laugh. It is certainly not to disturb the secure curtain of reality, which hides from our eyes what. And if it makes you more comfortable to consider all that has happened merely an illusion, well then by all means you be comfortable. But the definition of illusion is that which is unreal. 
Now the clown was soaking wet, wasn't he? And that's reality. And the clown never left this trailer. And that's reality. And the prison cell in which Tom Reagan will spend so many years, that is most certainly reality. But, as I said, be comfortable. In a moment, something about next week. Next week, and every week, we'll be bringing you the personal records of the rarest kind of human experience. Man's adventure in the world of the unknown. That mysterious psychic world beyond our five senses. This is your invitation to take with us that astonishing one step beyond. Thank you.